Hi everybody, I'm Matt Gash with SoundersFC.com here in Alajuela, Costa Rica, where the Sounders got two goals from Freddy Montero and a stand-up defensive effort to close out the game. They win 2-1 over Herediano to improve to 3-0 in the Champions League group stage. Freddy Montero got the Sounders off to a fast start, taking a pass from Nate Jaqua and hammering it home in the third minute for a 1-0 lead. Jaqua nearly made it 2-0 in the 26th minute, knocking a hard-hit volley into the post. Seattle controlled play, but Herediano evened it up just before halftime after Roger Levesque was called for a foul in the box, and Jose Cancela scored the PK to even it up at 1-1. That score wouldn't hold long, though, as Montero lunged to ensure that Levesque's left-footed shot in the 54th minute would find the back of the net. Casey Keller made some key stops late in the match, and the Sounders held on for the 2-1 victory. You know, last year we were disappointed in our performance in Champions League, you know, uh, maybe even a little bit embarrassed, and uh, it was definitely a goal we had set for ourselves that we wanted to do better uh, as we came back into it. And uh, to win two of our first three games on the road uh, makes it even even that much, uh, you know, uh, greater of an accomplishment at this stage. So we're very proud of what we've done. For me, it's good for the team because we get three points, very important. It's a big step to look forward for what we want is to be in the next round of CONCACAF Champion League. With Montero scoring both goals with assists from Nate Jaqua and Roger Levesque, it was a great performance from the attacking trio. I think we had some good plays. Roger, Roger pushes up quite a bit and kind of steps in the middle. He doesn't play like a true true winger. And, um, you know, sometimes we one of us would slide out there as well. And I think we did a good job kind of rotate and mix it up and, and finding each other. And, um, yeah, the first goal was a perfect example of that Roger was able to find me. Freddie made a very good run, was able to slip it in, and he had a great finish. I think it worked out well. You know, I mean, Nate's uh, size certainly helped us there. That was one of the things we were looking to do. We felt that we would have that advantage on them. Uh, the first goal was a great ball played by Nate into Montero. A good run by Freddie and he finished it well. Uh, you know, and the second goal was, you know, we tried to take advantage of Nate's size. He flicks it on. I think Roger is the one who got it and, uh, and scored the goal. In the end, Seattle adopted a bend but don't break mentality that held strong to earn the important victory. The defense stepped up, you know, we tried, as we inserted James Riley, we tried to go with more or less a 5-4-1, uh, you know, so we wanted to do that one, get San Yang into midfield uh, to give some help to Carrasco just, just defensively, uh, you know, and obviously they were floating a lot of balls in the box. We feel pretty confident about our abilities in the air, uh, maybe needed to pressure the ball a little bit more, but, uh, but the defense held strong, you know, we came up with some big headers, made some big saves, you know, caught crosses that we should. And, uh, and sometimes, you know, when you're away from home like this, that's just what you need to do to get the win. The Sounders will be back to CenturyLink Field on Saturday. They'll face D.C. United at 6 o'clock with a chance to clinch a playoff berth. From Alajuela, Costa Rica, I'm Matt Gash with SoundersFC.com. The Sounders are proud to partner with Special Olympics as we spread the word to end the word. I'm James Riley. When I hear people use the R word, retard, I think of my friend Stuart, a Special Olympics athlete who has an intellectual disability. Please join my teammates and me and take the pledge to stop using the R word. It hurts Stuart and it hurts the team. Sign the pledge today at the Special Olympics booth in soccer celebration on the main concourse. Spread the word to end the word. Thank you.